it's back. The Geneva Drive mechanism. Today, I'm going to try to take this to the next level. Will it work? Let's find out. In my previous video about the Geneva Drive, I showed how I designed and made this little mechanism. And I found it a really interesting device with rotary motion constant on one side and intermittent motion on the other. So it's transferring constant motion into an intermittent motion on the other side. Well, these all have four slots. So every time it spins, it just spins one quarter of the way around. I wondered if it would be possible to design the Geneva Drive with six slots instead of four. Well, I thought it would be fairly easy to take my original design with four slots and add two more slots to make it six. But when I tried to animate it, as you'll see here, I realized that the pin could enter the follower, but then it would collide and crash as it came back around. So obviously something was wrong in the design as the slots are not in the right place and the pin is not coming in and something needs to be adjusted from the pin design to the follower as far as the sequence and ratio. So I started over and thankfully I found the channel Maker's Muse and Angus uh, of Maker's Muse had a design for a six slot cam Geneva drive and I followed his instructions and kind of modified it a bit and he has a follow-up uh, video as well for that to show a mistake he had and after following that I was able to design it and see the animation that was intended with the design where the cam is going around and meeting the slots well and moving it one sixth of the rotation with each turn. It looks good on the computer and now is the time to output it and send it to my printer and to see how it will work. So here's the three parts for the six slotted Geneva drive. You can see here's the base and we have the follower with six slots across and a follower. Notice how much smaller this follower is than the previous one with four slots and also the follower grew in size as well. So let's put it together and see how it does. Let's put the little pin cam on first and the slot follower All right, so they are on the base. You can see it looks quite a bit different than the four slotted one with six slots around. And we have the pin. Let's give it a try here. Yes, and it's working. So the little cam and pin are going in the slots and moving it just one sixth of the way with each rotation. So you can see for, again, constant rotation on one side, we're getting intermittent but slower movement. So it takes more revolutions for the input as far as the output will go. Well, we had success, and this was a lot of fun, making this little mechanism, kind of a derivation of the first one, taking it one step up. Have you made one? Have you tried it? What do you think? If you learned something, if you enjoyed this video, please give us a like. Also, we'd appreciate your support for the channel by hitting the subscribe button down below. Thanks a lot and have a great day.